I'm really proud with the way we played all year. We got better every game. Uh, we won 12 games this year. That's a five-game improvement. Um, the guys worked hard in and out of the pool, in the weight room, during practice. You know, you could just really tell all year that, that, that we just kept getting better and uh, kept understanding exactly what we were trying to accomplish in the pool. So I was real happy with the way the season ended up. Well, for me, I think when I came in, I, I, I wanted to obviously do better than they did last year. And that was, seven was the goal. And then once we hit eight, it was, okay, let's get to double digits. And then once we hit 10, it was, let's get to 12. I think, you know, it, the guys, we, we, we suffered a lot of injuries during the season. And we had a, a freshman go out for the rest of the year after our New York trip. So I think that it just shows how hard these guys have worked and uh, that, you know, we're going to keep getting better here. And Harvard Water Polo is going to take that step forward here real soon. You know, I guess you can never really be totally satisfied because, you know, I'm a competitive person and we didn't make Easterns, we're not going to the NC2As. And obviously those are the goals that I have, have set for myself and for the program. I like the way it started. I came in a little behind on, on a lot of things and, you know, getting higher July 2nd. But, you know, I, I think overall I'm real happy with the way it, it turned out and uh, I'm excited moving forward. And, you know, I don't, don't get much time to reflect because I hit the ground running with the women. Well, I think, you know, the first three you mentioned, obviously they led us in, in every category offensively and defensively all year. We went the way our seniors went, and we played, you know, behind our seniors, and they were the face of the program this year. Uh, Eric came in late, and I think Eric did a great job of coming in and being that person we needed to come in and help us in practice. Our numbers were thin, and he took that role, and, and then about three weeks in, I said, all right, man, we're going to activate you and put you on that roster. It was good for him, but, you know, the seniors meant so much, and that, after our last game, I told them I couldn't think of a better group of guys that I would want to start my college career with, and they're leaving the program, going in the right direction, and they're going to be proud of what we're going to do here in the future. Well, I think we really are going to start hitting the ground running. The, the guys are in the weight room today lifting. We're going to continue our lifting program. They're going to be coming in and swimming and, and doing all the skill work that we need to do and really working hard this offseason because we, we set goals for ourselves at the end of the season. It was next year we didn't want to be sitting here this week having these conversations and I need to be prepping for Easterns. And I think that's, that's a definite goal for us is to make Easterns and I think it's a very achievable goal. And then, you know, once you get to Easterns, anything can happen, you know. Like our friend's group says, NC2As are bust. I just really think I, I enjoyed my, my first collegiate season working with this, this group of guys and, and the girls. And, you know, it's just been real exciting to be here at Harvard and, and continuing the tradition of, of Crimson Water Polo. I'm, I'm really excited. And, you know, I, I think it's, it's nothing but great things ahead for us.